the Atlas is approaching Earth. You heard that right. It is not fake news. This is verified. I am going to explain to you what is going on. There's this news story here, see, from Futurismo.com. A mysterious interstellar object is now approaching Earth, right? This was also linked here on Brazilian portals, right? Science portals, news portals, and everything else talking about this approach. And some people are a bit curious. Huh, wasn't 13 Atlas going to leave the solar system? Now it is approaching Earth. Will there be a collision? Let's try to understand what is happening. So they are saying here that it is in a process of approaching Earth that will culminate on December 19th, when it will be closest to our planet. But what is this close to the planet? This image here that they are using to illustrate was captured by Hubble. It is Hubble's most recent image. But I'll explain about the image later. But how close will 13 Atlas be to us? Well, on December 19th, it will be 269 million kilometers from Earth. Is that close? I'll give you a comparison. Uh, the average distance between Mars and Earth is about 220 million kilometers. On the 13th, Atlas will be 269 million kilometers away. So Mars will be even closer to us than 13 Atlas. Well, actually, the distance between Mars and Earth keeps alternating, right? Because of the elliptical orbit, but that's the average. So it will be close, but even so, it is very far away. There is no risk of collision at all. Now, explaining this image here, which is the most recent image from Hubble, we have here the nucleus 13 Atlas, and this bluish thing around it is the coma, you know? It's a cloud of gases, ice, and debris that are there along with the comet, right? And there is this other image here that is talking about the material that was captured by JUICE, which is here on the European JUICE mission. Here is the 13 Atlas. Whoops, I messed up. There we go. Here we have the nucleus, its plasma tail, the common tail, and here a tail, a small tail made of dust. You know, the anticolor that everyone has been talking about, right? So, getting back to talking about the approach of 13 Atlas to Earth, this is very interesting because it will happen during the new moon, so it will be much better to make observations from here on Earth because the sky will be darker, there will not be the brightness of the moon overshadowing the 13 Atlas. So if you have a telescope, you know, get some programs of celestial object monitoring so you can find 13 Atlas and make your own images yourself, right? And during the approach period, telescopes here on Earth and in space will seize the moment to also capture more images of it. The James Webb will be used as well. So when I have these new images of the 13 Atlas, I will bring them here for you to not miss anything. Follow the page.